became an English teacher because my junior year of high school, I had a really bad experience. Like the teacher didn't connect with the students, kind of didn't know what was going on, really didn't make anything like fun or enjoyable or challenge me. And I, at that moment, I thought, oh, I feel like I could do this and like not let other kids have that same experience that I did. Oh, my favorite unit is definitely a reading unit and it's where students are really like tackling the stories that they're reading and how it connects to like society. I love when eighth graders get to talk about how things are um, like showing up in their world around them and they really start to figure out like what they're passionate about. So reading about issues that show up in our real world. She gets us all involved. Basically, at like the start of every class, she talks to us like rose, thorn, bud, something good, something medium, and something bad. We can answer anyone, or we can't answer at all, or we just don't have anything. And after that, she invites us to the middle of the classroom where she can give a presentation about what we're going to do today. So I became an English teacher firstly because my mom is a teacher and growing up she always told me that teaching was a great job and you got to work with a lot of kids. Um, so I always had that idea in my mind and then specifically English because I like to read and write so it was something I wanted to share with my students. Um, yeah, and that was kind of the inspiration totally. So reading books and writing essays are both super important because I think being a good reader helps you in all areas of your life. It can help you in any subject in school and also in any job. Um, you can learn about you know, other people's perspectives that are different than yours and their experiences and you can also learn new things about yourself when you read books and kind of just go into this whole other world. And then writing I think is also important because it's you know, your way of kind of getting your ideas out on paper and out there into the world and communicating effectively with people. Uh, I really like Miss Ross because she's really helpful and when she teaches it's like really easy to understand her and whenever we have questions it's like you can ask her and you don't have to feel uncomfortable.